According to Wetangula, claims that Kenyan youths were being recruited to fight in Somalia were false and alarmist. I have no official communication about any Kenyans being recruited. I've read it in the media. And in a statement to the newsroom's government spokesman, Dr. Alfred Mutua was categorical that Kenya had never recruited nor enlisted youths from the troubled Somalia for military purposes. Watangula also clarified that Kenya had only trained police and immigration officers as part of its regional responsibility like it did with Djibouti and Uganda. Kenya does not and has never either condoned or participated in the running of any mercenary forces. And while indicating that he had issued a warning to Al-Shabaab, the minister said anyone found engaging in recruitment of any foreigner or Kenyan for military purposes in Somalia will be arrested and prosecuted. Any non-Kenyans straying onto our soil for purpose of recruiting Kenyan youths, they are equally warned that that is contrary to our law, that is an act of aggression to our country, and appropriate measures can be and will be taken. Wotangula further insisted that Kenya is under no threat at all from the Al-Shabaab militia group in Somalia. He was speaking at a luncheon held following the presentation of credentials from newly appointed ambassadors, including those from Qatar, Niger, Sierra Leone, and Bosnia to the president. Helen Kimaru, Citizen TV.